it's really interesting to listen because some of the, the issues that all of you are facing, we are facing also. Uh, right to work and bringing in new people. But leadership, I think, uh, involves motivating people, listening, uh, working on lots of different ideas to engage different groups of members. How do you get new people involved in union activities? We've started a new program and we have focused on our early career teachers and asked them what they wanted and what we found out is that they really appreciate the union but they want the union to help them be the best they can be and they want to be doing community service with their students. So we started a grant proposal that they can then get a grant to do community outreach and then we have brought them in and talked to them about issues and then they become interested in the union. Whereas a lot of times our veteran teachers say just give them a history lesson and they'll learn it and we found that doesn't work. Uh, have you seen uh, a big difference uh, between before the grant program and after in, in the participation of, of young teachers? It's pretty new. We've only been doing it a year, but I just had word yesterday that we have a new grant proposal and 150 people have put in for grants. And so I've seen some of these really young people see that there's this camaraderie and they're becoming more interested in getting active in their local union. And so I think it's going to pay off in the long run. Is this something that other unions in the NEA uh, have done, or are you uh, the, the, the test lab for that kind of thing? We're pretty unique, uh, although NEA helped with the grant money. So uh, NEA really supports the idea of what are we, what are we doing to engage new members. And other states are doing different kinds of projects. Ours is just a, a different approach. And what advice would you give our union leaders uh, as to how they can get not only young teachers, but pretty much every member to, to be mobilized for, for their, their work conditions? Well, I don't want to make it sound like all of our members are mobilized, <laughs> but I, I think I think the main piece is to reach out and to listen and to invite them in. Every person I've ever talked to when asked how did you get involved in the union, they always answer, somebody came and asked me. So it's that relationship building and asking, come along with me to a meeting or let's go do this activity. And when they see that collective work, they just get turned on to.